Hey y'all, it is coming up on my birthday. You know, we all reach an age where we dread a birthday a little more than we look forward to a birthday, right? <laughs> but for me and my two older brothers, we've always dreaded our birthdays. You see, we're all holiday babies. My oldest brother is a Christmas baby. My middle brother is a Halloween baby. Now he got the best deal out of all that. What, what boy doesn't love a spooky birthday party? And me, the youngest, the most kind, the sweetest and most charming and most handsome baby of the family. My birthday is a Valentine's baby. So that's been my cross to bear for my whole life because as a child, my mother insisted on us having themed birthday parties associated with our holidays for all of our birthdays. Now, as a little child, a pink and red heart-shaped cake is, is fun and whimsical. But by the time you're in the seventh grade and your mother is bringing out a pink heart-shaped cake and pink and red streamers and pink stuffed animals everywhere, it's a little tough on a, on a young man. So um, I remember when I asked my mother, I said, Mom, for my birthday this year, can I just have a plain chocolate cake in a pizza party? And she cried. Oh, my Valentine's baby. It broke her heart. But I insisted. <laughs> she, one time, I was working in, in Dallas, Texas. At an, I was an executive at United Healthcare, and my mother had them deliver a Baskin Robbins ice cream cake to my office so I could share with everyone that worked with me. You know, Baskin Robbins does not deliver, right? <laughs> she managed to pull it off. People also ask me when they hear that, they say, did your mother plan that? Lord, have you met my mother? My mother in no way planned to have her babies around the holidays. But I'd like to give some quick advice to mothers. If you have a holiday baby, don't force that burden on them. And even maybe if you have a Christmas baby for sure, change that birth date and celebrate during May or, or September. There's no law that says you have to have a birthday party on the birthday. You know, that's just a tough thing for a kid to always be associated and God forbid I want to go out to dinner on my birthday. You can never get a reservation. And everybody, nobody wants to go do anything because they want to go off with it and be lovebirds. So I'm down on Valentine's Day. And I uh, just want to tell you, if that's your birthday, I pity you. Let's go do something anti-Valentine's Day. Maybe we'll go throw eggs at somebody. 